going on guys super mellow man gaming back with another video and today guys i am back at you guys with another tutorial i know i haven't been doing tutorials in a long time but um i think it's about time we start uh getting started with some more tutorials so uh today i'm going to be showing you guys how to save a game on roblox that you've created on uh roblox studio now assuming that you guys are already finished with your game since you clicked this video um I really shouldn't have to explain how to start making a game. If I do, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, I'll make a separate tutorial on that. But it's quite simple. All you gotta do is download... Uh, it's a dual pack. Download Roblox. Uh, it comes with Studio and Player. Go in Studio, build your game. If you don't know how to build a game, um, I don't really know exactly. I'm not the best at building. Um, so you're gonna have to look at another tutorial for that. And just save it. All right. But um, today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to save it. So it's quite simple. So, I already have a pre-made uh, thing, I made this, um, and this literally took 5 seconds to make, I know, uh, but it's just like a little, I don't know, building that I just made, and I put a little spawn here, just cause, um, uh, but I grouped it, put it into a model, and um, let's just pretend this is something that I want to get famous, now I know it's not going to get famous, um, it would be a waste to uh, advertise a game like this, uh, but I promise you guys, yours will be better than this one, trust me. So, what you guys want to do is, once you're completely done, make sure you're completely done. Yes, you can sh you can upgrade it, um, or update it, excuse me, um, and change things in the future, of course. But, um, I recommend you just get it, get it as much done as you possibly can, alright? Uh, so, once you're done, you're going to go to the file up here in the top left, and you're going to click that. Now, there are going to be many options, though, um, and you might not know which one to pick. So... Don't be that gullible person and click save as or save. Now, yeah, I mean, you can do this and it will save, but it's going to save to your file explorer. Now, if you're going to, if you wanted to save your file explorer to uh, use it later, um, and it's a new project, like it's a new base plate, then click save as. If you've never saved it before, click save as and you want to go to your file explorer. If you have saved it to your file explorer before and you just want to, like, update it, um, like, you know, just update the game, and then when you're done, you obviously have to save it, just click save. It will save to the file that's already there. If you put save as, it's going to save another file. So, I recommend you just save it once you already, uh, have one there for you. That's the same map, just updated. Once you want it to go to Roblox, though, you're going to go right below it, and it works the exact same way. If it's new, you're going to want to publish to Roblox as. If it's not new, oh, yeah, if it's not new, you're going to publish to Roblox. So, if it's not new, you updated it, yeah, you're going to publish it to Roblox. Okay, guys, so, um, this is actually an old world, so I'm going to click Publish to Roblox, because this, uh, world is older, um, than you think. But, uh, if you're going to do Publish to Roblox as, it's just going to take you here, and you're just going to create a new place, but I don't need to see it's right here. So, um, I'm just going to act like I did something, which I really didn't. I didn't move it around a little actually, so I'm going to put Publish to Roblox, and it automatically saved for you on Roblox. So that's basically it, and then from there you can edit it to uh, your um, account, and you could have it as your active game. If you have Builders Club, of course, you can have many active games at once, you can do many things with it. If you have Builders Club, you could advertise, you could, uh, I think you can make game passes uh, for non-Builders Club, but I'm not sure. Um, but you could do many more things with Builders Club, so if you're planning on making a huge game and you know how to script and all that, I recommend just getting Builders Club, um, maybe a month or so, um, and, you know, you could definitely do it. But if you're not skilled and you're learning, don't get Builders Club right away. Um, if you're, you're planning on using that for a game, of course, don't get Builders Club right away. Wait until you feel confident enough to where you can make your game and get it as famous as you possibly can. So, uh, yeah, that's really all you have to do. I mean, of course, it doesn't have to be a game you're trying to get famous. It could be a game that you just want to play with your friends. Um, but that's basically it. It's very simple. Um, if you guys want a tutorial on how to, uh, like I said at the beginning, if you want a tutorial on how to start a game, which is also very simple, uh, let me know. If you want a tutorial on how to uh, make it so that that can be your game on your profile, like the active one, so people can play it, because not all games are active. Uh, so if you want a tutorial on that, let me know in the comment section below as well. And um, anything else you guys want to see Roblox-related tutorial-wise, let me know, and I will definitely get back to you guys on that. Thank you all for watching. Um, 
I really appreciate it. Uh, I will see you guys on another video. Like, comment, subscribe. Later.